Hi everyone, my name is Leah and welcome to the kitchen. I hope you all had a happy Thanksgiving. In this week's video, we're going to be making a recipe from my Nona, Italian for grandmother, and she likes to call it a holiday crunchy munchie. It's this really nice bread with almonds on top and sprinkled Gruyere cheese. Whenever I think of this bread, I think of the holidays as we all go over to Nona's house for dinner on Christmas. Let's get started. For this recipe, you need green onion or scallions, flour, almonds, Gruyere cheese, eggs, butter, Dijon mustard, and some water. Begin by slicing the green onions. Grate 3 quarters cup of Gruyere cheese. Measure a half cup of sliced almonds and spread them on a baking sheet. Lightly toast the almonds at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 minutes. Take the almonds out halfway throughout to stir. Continue to toast the almonds until they are a nice light brown. Add one stick of butter to a saucepan. Pour in one cup of water. and add two tablespoons of Dijon mustard. Heat to a rolling boil. Add in one cup of flour and stir with a wooden spoon until the mixture forms a ball. Remove the saucepan from the heat and add in four eggs, one at a time, stirring well after each egg until the mixture is smooth and elastic. Add in half of the toasted almonds and the sliced green onion. Stir to incorporate. Drop by spoonfuls on a baking sheet lined with parchment paper. You will want to form an 8 inch ring. Use your fingers to smooth out the ring and distribute the dough evenly. Sprinkle the grated Gruyere cheese all over the top of the ring. Then, spread the remaining almonds all over the top as well. Bake in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for one hour until well browned. This holiday crunchy munchy bread smells amazing with the toasted almonds and the melted Gruyere cheese on top. It is perfect to serve as an appetizer for any upcoming holiday. If you're interested in the recipe, be sure to check out the link in the description box below. If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more delicious recipes. 